So Pokemon Go is still taking the world over by storm and some companies are taking full advantage of it. Like this company, they just released a bunch of Pokemon sex toys. And that's right, they're called Pokemon. So if you want to heat things up in the bedroom, then the Charmander one is for you. If you want to see some sparks fly, use the Pikachu one. My advice is, stay away from the grass type because that will leave you with a bubble saw. My name is Shanti and this is The Scoop. Today on the show, she won't follow you home unless you have a Pikachu in your bedroom. It's Liz. And also, I owe her $60, but don't ask me why. It's our current Miss Universe Singapore, Lisa Marie. Two of you are hot young women. And I'm sure a lot of guys come up to you and uh, try to pick you up or ask you out. Mm -hmm. So let's talk about how you guys savagely reject them. I've never actually said no to a guy. I've just been like, oh. I just misdirected it and been like, oh, I actually have a boyfriend or, oh, uh, you know, I give them a fake number or something, but I never say no. What about you? I, I'm i exactly the same. Like, I feel really bad rejecting a guy. Uh, there was one time a guy came up to me as I came off the MRT, and he followed me all the way to the bus stop, which was like a 10 minute walk. And the whole time he kept stalker, trying to yeah. get my number. So he was just like, oh, what are you doing now? So, you know, oh, why don't we catch up with a coffee since we, we live so nearby? Yeah. And I was just like, oh, okay. <laughs> well, I was so freaked out. I got in the first bus that came, even though it brought me nowhere near my place. Wow, mm. we are very fragile creatures. So I don't think we can take that savage rejection as well. So I think what you guys are doing are very nice, but also it plays with our feelings. It makes us feel like we have chance. Oh, that's true. That's true. Hmm. Hey beautiful, so do you know where the train station um, is? Huh? I'm sorry, I don't speak English. Oh, okay, so sorry. But you, huh? Then how? Wait. What kind of guy would you generally reject? Um, That's guys... a tough question. Yeah, we ask only the real questions here. I'll be honest, um, I'm a bit shallow, so it has to be a little bit good looking. Okay. And um... <laughs> hey, give a it's given. It's given. As a, a, a guy... Okay, I, I understand. Come on, even for guys, it's yeah. important. You wouldn't approach a That's girl number one, yeah. attractive, right? Yeah. And then, um, if I think if he was being rude, or if he was being cocky, that's a big turn off. What are you doing? Uh, nothing. I'm just like. <laughs> I always thought you were gay. Me? No. Why? <laughs> okay. Uh, I'm gay. Sorry. Like, now? Just. What are some examples that you would say are uh, savage uh, rejections? I was at Zook a couple of weeks back mm -hmm. and um, a few like drunk NS boys approached me and you could tell they were NS boys because they had like the NS boys starter pack you know yeah. they had like no hair <laughs> out at Zook on a Friday night and they had the cat you know oh, and then and uh, so one of them was really drunk and um, he came over to me and he was like hey uh, you're really cute like what's your name and I was just like oh man I think I'm a little bit too old for you he was like no no and I can't be like what's, <laughs> what's your name I was just like sweetie I think I really think I'm too old for you um, and he was like no 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 just tell me your name and I was like don't you have a curfew you're, you're a bit too young to be <laughs> you out you said that I did I did I just drag my friend along and be like, um, this is my boyfriend by the way. Oh, like, nice yeah. to meet you, see you. So, but you are like Miss all. Universe Singapore all style and grace, you have to be like, yeah, polite for now lah. Wait until the crown, you know, <laughs> gone to somebody else already, it's like, yeah, you are, go away lah, don't talk to you. That's the way I ward off uh, shorter men, I just always wear heels. Oh yeah? Like, you're not taller than me on heels, uh, don't even talk to me. Just keep looking straight at you, then someone's like, Lisa, who? <laughs> what? What's no, happening? No, 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 no. Oh, I didn't see you there. <laughs> hey, you're cute. What are you doing Monday? Uh, hit it. Oh. <laughs> so uh, Tuesday? <gasps> gonna be so sick, bedridden. Cannot get out. Wednesday? My dog's gonna die. Yeah. <laughs> it's a whole big thing. I'm gonna be so upset. How oh, you know <laughs> this thing before it happens? You're like, <laughs> You're not supposed to be here because you're smoking. Hot. Aww, you're so cute. You actually think you have a chance with me. I have this, this guy friend of mine, and he's been asking me out the past seven times, and I've rejected him all seven times. And you know what? At this point, I'm like, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna go out with him just to make him happy. So, yeah. <laughs> Oh, charity work you can see. What thing? This fellow who is it? Name, name? No, no, no. no I'm not later, you tell me. There was a guy who was chasing me, but the, the worst part was that he was attached. Oh. Uh, and he he yeah. kept just trying to get with me, and I told him no. And in the end, he just told me like, look, 
whenever I'm out with you, like I'm in pain because I, I can't, um, you know, like do anything with you that I want to. So um, he, he, he dealt me an ultimatum. He basically said, let's uh, progress this relationship that we have or we can't even be friends. What? And I just said, okay, then we can't be friends. And that was the end of the friendship. And I thought it was a pity because he was a really great friend. Hmm. If you're watching this, I'm really sad about it. I haven't gotten over it. Hello. Hey, you want to go out sometime? When you free? Um, sure. I can do February 30th. February 30th? Okay, I can. I'm always free for you. Man. Okay, okay. I'll see you soon then. See you. Score! Lisa Marie and me, February 30th. Hey, Glenda spoil. Like, heaven not finished work of February 30th. Wow, I think the Glenda spoil. Better call Apple. Customer service. Hello, Apple. Hey, your Glenda spoil. Lo. Hi. Hey, babe. Anybody home tonight? Can I come over? Tonight? Uh. Yeah, no one is home tonight. Sure, 9 p.m. No one is at home. What, wow, really? Nobody's home, ah? Yeah. Hello? Hello? Anybody home? Hello? Wow. Really nobody at home? <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys! If you'd like us to talk about anything else, just comment below. Till the next episode, see ya! Do you smoke? Because I think I'm addicted to you. Right. Sorry, but I think you're kind of ugly. Cut. Okay. Good.